Yo, what's up everybody? How's it going? Today we're playing some World of Dota, which is of course made by Panda Life. And we're still working our way through the new heroes. Today, we're playing Techies. Hello friends! Today we're playing Techies in World of Dota. We're gonna be going for the Int path, which is fine-ish, according to Nail. From what I've seen, it's been kind of underwhelming, but I thought we could give it a try together. I have to record a lot of stuff this week, which means I don't have as much time to test things. That's because Tusky is uh, going on vacation next week, which he has well earned, but also it means uh, I, 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 we're gonna, we might need to do some editing ourselves. I want to avoid that. <laughs> oh no! Oh, come on, go away! Go away! Why are you attacking me? <laughs> no! This is <laughs> not like this! What is your problem? I hate pop players. They are the worst. Okay. Well, this is a terrible start. I just I just wanted to farm a little bit, if that's alright. We can get ourselves some extra radius here, which is actually pretty nice. Uh, one of the big problems with techies is, uh, of course, uh, long cooldowns and high mana costs. Uh, so that doesn't help in that way, but big radius is still good. That's still nice. Should help us a little bit with farming, which is something that we struggled with during the early game. Alright, here's Blast Off. Oh, hello. Oh, no, not again! What are you doing? No! Why is this guy always chasing me? <laughs> oh, my life. Oh, horrible. Truly, truly horrible. Okay. Well, I, I can't go over there. Can I? No, not really. Oh man, where are we headed? Let me just get, let me just get this. So I have a little, no! No! Oh my God, I just need to farm, please. I have no fighting power, I'm a level two techies. Okay. Alright, we've, we've taken down a camp, sort of, not in its entirety, but we're working on it. Oh, what a truly, true, no, no! Why do you do this to me? Oh god, oh god, okay. Oh, this is not going well. Well, this is a big camp. I would like to kill it, but like, I, I don't think I can. I don't think it's a good idea. Alright, throw this over here. We really just need, like, a level. If I can get one level, I can get this to a higher a higher level. And then, uh, you know, like, it's got a much lower cooldown and it does a bit more damage. It seems like a good thing to get. So, uh, just one level, please, for the love of God. That's all I need. Well, actually, I need a lot more than that. But I'm, I'm just kind of trying to get myself in a better mental position here. Alright, we'll go heal. We'll go heal. Uh, we're gonna need some items. We're gonna need a Kaya. That's like 100% always happening. We already know that. Uh, throw this over there. Luckily that Wind Ranger didn't feel like fighting us. So I'm very glad about that. I'm not entirely sure why she didn't feel like fighting us. But I'm not gonna complain. And then we're gonna take these guys down. And here's a, here's a guy over there. Throw that in. And, uh, yeah, this is actually, like, kind of usable now, right? 13 seconds. It's just... We're working on it. We'll get the reactive taser. Helm of Ironville. These are all very nice. Oh, God. Okay. Um, hmm. Interesting. Well, I, I would have liked that, but I guess I... I guess you can have it. That's fine. Just leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. I just want this. Okay, I got it. I'm fine. Let's run. Let's run. Let's run. Let's run. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that guy might be might continue chasing the Marcy, but I guess he didn't feel like it. So, we'll get some extra spell damage. I don't really want to get any mana in the early game, even though it would be beneficial, but uh, it's just one of those things that stops being useful very, very quickly if you're playing an int hero. Uh, and even though Techies does have pretty high mana costs, they are not that high, like, long term after we have a couple of items. So, yeah. Anyways. Sticky Bomb. Leveled up. That's a huge camp. Ooh, okay. There's there's also a, a situation. Mm. Okay. We have stuck this guy. We jump. We kill him. Wow. That's kind of crazy. We got a kill. When taking damage from a hero, automatically cast Sticky Bomb on them. So we get ourselves another Sticky Bomb. That's sick. 
Uh, do I start trying to chip this down? This is such a terrible idea. Okay. Ew, this is gonna take all day. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> this is not worth it. Oh god. Come here. Okay, good. Does this work on the creeps? Uh, kind of, yeah. There's a punch. We'll just hope he doesn't come over here. Please die, please die, please die. One more hit, one more hit. Okay, we're good, we're good. We're level six. We run, we run, we run, we run. All right, level this up some more. So we're just casting sticky bombs on people. We get the minefield here eventually. Proximity mines can be placed nearby. Increased proximity mines damage based on our int. So we want int. So this is a good item. Spell crit is gonna be good. Because it's int based. Oh, this guy has a shield. Oh man, your shield is just way too much. Come on. Yes, yes, okay. Techie's getting kills, let's go. Let's go, the dream is alive. No, not again. God damn it. Uh, I guess it's just gonna keep happening, right? What else do we get? Reactive trace taser triggers health and mana regeneration. So we heal a little bit. Oh, I guess that's okay. Huskow versus uh, the bird. Uh, it seems like seems like a free win for the bird, to be honest. Seems like something that should go... Sorry, not to the bird. Uh, to the Huskar. He's gonna make some fried chicken, is what I'm saying, okay? The bird is gonna die. I'm sorry. That's just what's gonna happen here. Go get it. Go in there, my friend. Go get him. No burning spear. We don't need that. So... We're now an int hero, which reduces our physical damage output. But like honestly, that's not actually that big of a deal anymore. Because this actually it actually only has seven seconds cooldown now. Like that's genuinely pretty good. That is totally fine. So none of this scales off of mana. It's just int. Well, that's perfect. That means we have don't have to go for any of this this mana stuff. So we just go for we just go for int. And then we go for some you know, general utility, survivability, that kind of thing. Bonk. Bonk. Very good. We kill him. We get this as well. Oh, man, we're doing great now, actually. Now, that's crazy, isn't it? Take down you. Do I level up Blast Off? To be honest, I think I'm leveling up Reactive Taser. Oh, I don't like this. Go away. Oh, you got, you got two of them. Damn. That's actually a little crazy, isn't it? Just throws two sticky bombs at people. Okay, hello. I missed with one of them. That's definitely not great. <laughs> okay. More disarm. I, I'm I'm dead, yeah. I could have bought some mangoes. I was looking for them, but I it's just uh, opening up the shop, finding the mangoes. Oh, okay. Honestly, we died there the moment we missed our our cast. We shouldn't have missed that. Okay, there's two heroes that are on low HP. Okay, one hero's dead. The other hero's dead too. Double kill. Let's go, Techies! Whoever said this hero is bad? Look at that. We've got this maxed out now. These should actually hurt quite a bit now, right? Yeah, it's not bad. 500 damage. Something. Okay. Yeah, my autocast is better at hitting these than I am. <laughs> That's alright. That's alright. To be honest with how big the radius is, what I'm trying to do is I'm kind of predicting where people are going, right? Where people are gonna move, and then I'm trying to hit them there. But the radius is actually so big, I can just throw it right at them, and it should hit. It should connect. So I'm kind of like overthinking it a little bit, but that's okay. I there's an invoker. Ah, okay.
Hello. Very good. Nice. Um, just do another one of these. Wait, that didn't connect? How am I missing these? <laughs> Got him. <laughs> nice. Grab this. And then proximity mines can be placed nearby. Although we're still a little bit away from that. Uh, okay, so we have this. I think we want the Yules. I think we want an Octarine core. So let's just immediately get started on these. Did you know that if you carry cats through videos for often enough, they get really annoyed and want to leave? Well, I hope you don't want to leave. Please leave a rating on the like on the video. And oh my God, my arm, oh, I'm being bitten. Okay, I gotta go, sorry. And... Wow, okay, yeah, no. I definitely do not have the techies practice I need. All right, nice. Disarm you, then we do this. I mean, I'm dead, but he should be too. Yeah. Problem now, the invoker summons don't, or like can't be damaged anymore. They're just invincible now. So we can't really do anything to them. And that's definitely making things a bit more difficult. Hello, Marcy. Die. Die. <laughs> Got her. <laughs> Level this up. More int. Brain power. It's great too. We can get two points here. And actually, it actually all adds up kind of perfectly. So I think we'll get a Yules first. It gives us a lot of mana. And it gives us like some nice added utility. Just in case we need that. Wow. Also gives us a bit of int. Which uh, our mines do a lot of damage. Hello. Good. Throw one of these. I mean, it's not gonna kill. I am setting myself up to get hooked. Yeah, that's fine. And now we run. Nice. Whew, that was close, but we got there. But we got there. So, more spell damage. We're all about spell damage. Gotta go ahead and uh, just kind of nuke people down like that. Isn't there? Who's here? Somebody just killed that. What could that have been? Skyrath? No. This is a Husker, okay. I'm silenced. Okay. Oh, shit. Yeah, right. This arm. We got that. We died to... Huskar anyways, but that's okay, I guess. Kill is a kill. We're happy about getting a kill. So level this up. We can reduce the activation delay. So we need these. We definitely want the cooldown reduction. This seems worse. But we'll probably just get it anyways, because, you know, that's what we're here to do. And I think I'll get rid of this and get some stats. Between these two, Wind Ranger. Seems like a good matchup, mostly. So, yeah. For Marcia at the body we stand. No, Marcy has, like, if you go for the Int Path, I think you create an illusion of yourself. And you can use that to, like, sidekick. That's the idea. One of the problems with that, of course, is that you have an illusion. Which illusions aren't very good, but hey, maybe it is usable, who knows. Yeah, so the uh, Windrun is definitely carrying here. That's what I thought. So that's good. We get ourselves some extra points. Invoker's out of the game. I was actually worried about Invoker because if those Forge Spirits eventually become strong enough that, you know, they, they are a serious threat, we actually can't really do anything about that. So... Forge Spirit's gun, it's great. Really good for us. And we definitely want an E-Blade as well, right? So we can proximity mines. Although, the question is with this reduction, is it even important? No. We actually don't have to disarm people at all. This will come This will come down so quickly and activate so quickly that it should be fine. 
Oh, okay. Nice. See what I mean? And that's not even maxed out yet. Like, this just activates quickly enough that this kills. Like, we will just be able to get... We'll just be able to, to hit people with it. Shouldn't be much of a problem. Alright, take these. Bonk. Didn't quite get him. Hmm, that's the awkward... Awkward part about all of this, right? Yeah, our farming isn't great. We can farm pretty quickly if we use the ultimate. But I don't really want to use the ultimate. Because we do need that for our... Or like for any, any fights that might come up. So... There are some problems here. Oh, they just respawned? Right. <laughs> well, that's good. We'll take down you. Shiva's guard is probably also a good idea here, but I don't... I'm not sure how much we need that. Let's get cooldown reduction first. Hello. Oh, wow. Well, that was quick. Point booster, thank you. More cooldown reduction. That way we have our proximity mines available more frequently. There's no way we can kill that camp. This camp is super, super, super strong, so... We need to be realistic about our possibilities here. <laughs> that one isn't happening. And we'll take down you. Run over here. Guys, today is finally the day. Well, the day I'm recording this. By the time you see this on YouTube, this has already happened. But you know what? I'm going to talk about it anyway. It's finally the day that we are releasing the last stories of Dota video. It's done. It's finished. It's not perfect. I spotted a small editing error, but we're not going to be fixing it. <laughs> That's okay. Yeah, I want it out today, and if we were to fix that, that would delay everything by another day, and I don't want that. It's time to be done with it. I also don't think a lot of people will even notice. But it's just, it's just so nice, you know? Like, it's... I'm really happy with the video, and uh, I'm just glad to kind of like have a, a closing note on all of that. You know what I mean? I don't want this. I would actually like to fight. Oh, very good. That's kind of annoying that the Wind Ranger. Hello. Pop. <laughs> Alright, more int. Sorry, what was I saying? Oh yeah, it's kind of annoying that the Wind Ranger just triggered our mine. But we still managed to get both of them. We still got them both. Take down these. How much damage does one of these do? I mean, it's just one shot that camp. And one shot in camps isn't super easy. <laughs> Let's go, techies. So, when an enemy hero passes within 200 radius of the minefield sign, a 1000 radius area around it becomes a minefield, dealing damage to moving enemies. So, I can now place this. What's the cooldown on this? A couple seconds? Oh, it's really quick. Wait. No, 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 that's, that's, I was thinking for a moment. Oh, hello. Are you sure you want to come in here? No, I can't move. Hmm. I'll just put down a ward and if somebody wants to mess with me, I'm happy. This is actually where Techies is amazing, right? Because Techies is already such a defensively minded hero. That just one shot a blue creep. God damn, Techies, I was not giving you enough credit. I thought this build wasn't good. I thought Techies kind of sucked in general. And, I don't know, he probably 
does kind of suck in general. And mostly just because he has such a weak early game. Remember that early part of the video where we just spent the entire time running away? Yeah, that's the section where Techies really struggles. And you might say, oh, is that really that big of a deal? Kind of is, yeah, actually, that part is a problem. Um, and that's because if you're weak during that early section, you are forced into duels immediately, lose the duels, and then you just, you know, get knocked out. So that's a big problem. We somehow managed to work our way through that. But yeah, Techies wasn't strong in that regard in any way. But now, at this point, Tech's pretty alright. Oh, I was stunned the whole way through. So we have this now. Yeah, you know what? Let's get this. Let's get ourselves reactive taser healing. That seems fun enough. So, where were we? Seems like the wind ranger is just way stronger. Do we like any of this? Comfy sweater, probably? Yeah. Some extra damage, right? Remember your other video where you stated that the first round doesn't matter? The first round sort of doesn't matter. Like, okay. Hmm. Yes, I see what you're saying, how these are kind of contradictory. The problem is, when I say the first round doesn't matter, what I really mean is like you don't have to stress about doing super well during the first round. You just have to kind of keep up. And that's the part that techies can't do. That's the part that's difficult. So, I see what you're saying. I see how these seem like contradictory ideas. And maybe they are. Maybe I'm being a bit of a hypocrite right now. But I also think it makes some sense. We're going, we're going. Okay. Come over here, hello. Oh, well, we're just hanging out. Wait, where did, wait, God damn it. Oh, there she is. Nice. Got her. Cool. Just blew her up. Just blew her up into tiny little pieces. Wait, that's all the heal I'm getting. Oh, that's more like it. Oh, it triggers at the end. Interesting. <clears throat> we have TI-13 in the new stories of Thought of Anyone? No! <laughs> that ended this week! <laughs> no! How? How? How could we possibly? <laughs> oh, man. I actually need another Yules. Nice. Okay. Yeah, I need a second Yules, funnily enough. I just activate this for healing. I can trigger it early to get the healing early. Ah. Okay, let's get some HP. We just need some survivability, really. We're not going universal because, you know, we're not attacking. So there's no point to it. But we do want some healing. Healing is good. Oh, sorry. HP. Which is, in a way, healing. Kind of? No, that's stretching it. Anyway, you get the point. We'll just buy a second yours now. I'm buying the um, Atos yours upgrade. Because uh, I think it, it'll be good for keeping people in place. And that's something we are trying to do, right? Because we want to hit them with uh, the proximity mines. Bonk, bonk, bonk. This I shouldn't do, I think. <laughs> what I'm doing right now. We don't want to use all of our mines and have none left. That seems like a big mistake. Alright, in we go. Admittedly, at this point, our cooldown is low enough that we can just spam them a little bit. 
Don't they share cooldown? I don't think so. I mean, they are very different abilities. Like, they both build out of a yours, but... I, I don't really think they should. I Honestly, I don't know. Sure hope that they don't. Sure hope that they don't. That would be bad. Man, I do need another yours. Oh, I have one. Well, that's convenient. Nah, still died. Okay. Okay. Just, uh... <sighs> Just kind of got... Got, got right there. So, we should be pretty capable of taking down the Husk now. Don't you just want to leave bombs on the map? Why? What would be the benefit of that? Ah, I didn't get him. Because of his death prevention. Hmm, that's kind of unfortunate. Alright, things aren't looking super great right now. Yeah, it feels like now we are lacking a bit in the fighting department. Also, people have a lot of silences. An unusual amount of silences. <clears throat> hey, come over here. Thank you. Catching low HP heroes running through the map. I mean, that seems unlikely, doesn't it? I mean, sure, that could happen, but... What are the odds? I think it's better to use our ultimate just as an ability that we can use. Although I guess if I have maximum charges, then I might as well leave some mines. I mean, then it doesn't really have much of a downside. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Nice! Wait, that wasn't enough to, to move me up literally one spot? <laughs> I got two kills right there. <laughs> oh, man. Big struggle today. Melvin. Take down these guys. Jump over here. Mobility, right? That's how it works. It's so close in terms of farm. Kind of crazy. Do we like any of these? They kind of suck for us. I think I'll just get some money. I can finish up my Wind Waker. Okay. Hmm. I mean, this is an agility guy, but I think Huskar is Huskar, so that seems... That seems good. I don't know. Do we get Glimmer Shield? It's more cooldown reduction. Some movement speed, I guess. Bunch of int. It actually seems pretty alright. It seems nice. No way. No way the right click Skyrim Mage wins this. Come on now. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's more like it. So, we definitely don't get this barrier. This is terrible. <laughs> I think we'll get this, and then I might actually go and increase debuff duration over here. Just get something, right? Um, this is actually not that bad. It deals some damage in the area. 20% of our attack speed. It's what? Like 30 damage? 35 maybe? Oh. Would you mind not doing this? Man, these fresh PKBs. Bonk, bonk. Got her. <laughs> yeah, this is something that's a bit of a nightmare right now, but it will get better as we go along. Because uh, BKBs are gonna get used up. 
And as they get a lower duration, we should be able to handle them. How the hell do we kill a red creep? We're not good at this. Oh, hello. Who's that? Windranger or Windranger? Oh, look at that. Look at that combo line. Bonk, bonk. Got her. Nice. Uh, throw down one of these. Another mine. Another mine. Oh, no. It's not enough. There's a Marcy. Is it enough to get over here? Yes. Ah, oh, shit. I don't have vision. I will go for this. Up we go. Up we go. One of these. I should use my capstone. I haven't been using that very much, have I? Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I completely forgot I had it. Oops. But I got him. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. We are remembering. We are remembering our stuff. All right. This right here is gonna be a bunch of extra life. Uh, we get this for some small bits of extra damage. And since it's all attackers now, well, let's get some ethereal. I think the Marcy did end up getting that red creep, though, which is a bit unfortunate, but... Yeah, we're just not very good at securing those. How does this ward not see anything? So this is the field. I guess it does a little bit of damage. It's not too bad. I mean, for one point, especially since we got nothing else to do with our points, we might as well. All right, take down you. Very good. Jump over here. Oh, I regret everything. Okay. We're fine. I'm still somehow kind of behind on money. But... We're doing okay. Take these. Good. Some damage. I mean, honestly, with our really low cooldowns now, things are going okay. Increase debuff, increase debuff. I mean, everything is maxed out. I guess at this stage, we just get armor. Because what else is there to do? Maybe some spell I steal? Do we need spell I steal? Hmm. I guess. It's probably better than armor. Yeah. I just I just assume everybody has heating reduction. And I don't really think Techies is a very spell I steal kind of hero, anyways. But maybe. Bonk. Oh, hello. <laughs> that was actually kind of brutal. I definitely need to use this more. Wait, is somebody coming over there? There's a husk always waiting. Ah, oh, somebody's greedy. Come in here. Let's do this. I'm not afraid of you. That's why I placed a million mines. <laughs> Definitely the behavior of somebody who's not afraid of you. Take down these guys. I don't think I care much about you. That's an illusion. That's a pretty strong illusion. That's the real one. Up we go, up we go. Hmm, got me. But I got her. So I guess that's kind of okay. Just as long as we don't have to duel. I think we're doing okay in that regard. There's the Huskar. I think there's enough time to kill him. 
Oh. Now for sure. Bonk, bonk. Nice. Oh, there might even be enough time for this. Ooh, let's go. Uh, Book of Shadows, right? It's actually pretty good. I think we want Book of Shadows. What can we get? We can get better boots. Oh, the heal would be good. I'm going to go with Book of Shadows. For now, it's fine. I think we can get something better on the next, um, on the next map. But we'll we'll see then. We'll see then. Nice. Well, we made it to top three. Would you look at that? I'm surprised the Huskar survived that, though. I guess it's just like a lot of evasion here. And illusions are bad. I suppose that plays a factor. Replace boots with Dagon. Is that the way to go? Are we sure? <laughs> I think we probably want to get a Shiva Scar just so we have some armor. Or we could get Force... Oh, you know what? Force Plate Mail. That's actually, like, such a sick item here. Like, that's 100% the correct choice. It's kind of fun. We get to use a bunch of uh, pretty unique items right now. My kill! Never mind. Nah, nah, I'll take it. Maybe I won't. Who knows? Oh my god, please die. Okay, we got him. <laughs> okay. Got a double kill. Very nice. I mean, at that late of a stage, getting a double kill us. It's kind of sick. So, Askar, maybe a bit of a problem. Maybe just a tad little bit. Bonk, bonk. Take you down. Yeah, we have uh, the force plate mail now. Which is just what it sounds like. It's just force staff and plate mail tied together. But it does have a really nice additional benefit. Because it's a dispel. Mm -hmm. We don't buy this item very much. Because in a lot of scenarios, you have better dispels available. But right now, we need a dispel, we need mobility, and we need armor. Well... Isn't this just perfect? Should I use this? This doesn't trigger on creeps. Oh, it does. Wow. Look at that. Does a lot of damage against creeps, too. Activate you. For some healing. And haste rune. I'm not sure if we can do anything with that. That feels particularly impactful, but hey. Ooh. There's a situation. I'm dead. Hmm. Yeah, that was too greedy. The jump takes too long. I should have gone for something else. Well, friends, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait until I respawn, and then we're gonna fight some more, okay? I hope everybody's okay with that. I hope everybody's looking forward to it. Hello. Oh, the taunt. Ah, god damn it. 
I don't know how to beat the Huskell. I think that's just a really, really hard matchup. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. It's going to be a tough one. I guess I need some sort of Lincolns. I don't have a hundred percent uptime on this. Hello. She gun? Wow, you're fast. I guess we're not catching up to her. No, maybe we are. Who knows? Sometimes they do stupid stuff. Nice. No. Those got me? No. No. No, 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 no. That's not good. That's not good. Asuka, go farm. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I can beat the Wind Ranger and get second. I don't think I can. I don't think I can beat the Asuka. <laughs> I think that's just too much of a hero counter. Okay. Beat Daska. Nah, that's just unsportsmanlike. I get what you're saying, and it kind of makes some sense. But ultimately, I am still playing to win. I'm not playing to get second. If I was playing to get second, then yes, feeding the Huska would be right. At least I stole that. I need the Hoskow to get a good creep, but he's not gonna. Alright, so we're gonna need to just... Win against the Hoskow. Um, There's more cooldown reduction. Woodland Striders? I think it's Woodland Striders. No. Ah, these both suck. Okay, roll again. Resurrection? 200 damage return? Fuck it. Let's get let's get a resurrection. Maybe we can scam it. It's not time yet. This is gonna require some scamming. Mm-hmm, that's fine. Oh. Okay, we've got the Resurrection. Ah, it's not enough. <laughs> I think it's just it's just too hard of a matchup. Haska obviously has so many tools for dealing with the techies that... Yeah. No, that's okay, right? That happens sometimes. There are just certain hero matchups that are... Just really bad. They're just really bad. And I think this is one of them. Admittedly, I feel like the Haskell might run into a similar issue against this Wind Ranger here. But we'll see. This can be a bit more even. It depends on if Haskell can get much use out of his sleep. Think you have a chance of Vessel or Voicemail? Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe we could have done things a little bit differently. Overall, I'm fairly happy with my performance. I think we did alright. But yeah, there was definitely some improvements to be made. But just keep in mind, Huskar has a lot of magic resistance. He's got a lot of healing. Like, that's like his whole thing. That's that's what he's good at. So. Mm, she's not really doing enough damage. Yeah. Doesn't seem like Wind Ranger has enough damage. Well... Seems like the Oscar is just gonna take it then. That's good. GG, my friend. Nicely done. I mean, there's also more some magic damage. Yeah, but she's really fast. Like, she's not as static. I think Huskar is pretty famously a, her a hero where you don't want to just fight him head on. 
Right? If you ever find yourself just trading hits with a Huskar, well, that's how you lose. Nice. Alright then. Very good. Very well done. Friends, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to give the video a thumbs up. I would definitely appreciate that. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Goodbye.